Have you noticed that the women on the Weather Channel wear short dresses when it's freezing outside? In Atlanta, from where the Weather Channel televises, the temperature will fall to 28 tomorrow, 28 Fahrenheit. Yet, the female newscasters are parading around in short sleeves and bare legs. The CNN corporate guys on the top floor want their girls to look sexy. Ladies, these guys are exploiting you. Even when it's 15 degrees outside, the, these female anchors are in short sleeves, sometimes no sleeves, sleeveless short dresses. It's difficult to take Miss Sexy seriously when she stands there in a, in a skirt that doesn't even reach her knees, teetering on four-inch heels that OSHA should prohibit from the workplace, and her legs are bare. Now, these TV studios have high ceilings. I've been interviewed in these places, and, and you can never warm up. Now, if women refuse to go back to pantyhose or uh, nylon stockings with the garter belt, speaking of sexy, why don't they wear tights to keep their legs warm? Tights can be sexy, and they come in all colors to coordinate with the outfit. Why doesn't a newswoman dress like her male colleague? He wears a long sleeve shirt under a business suit. She could wear a long sleeve blouse under a blazer. He wears a, a necktie or a bow tie. She could wear a floppy silk bow tie like, like Jane Pauley wore on the Today Show. Ladies, dress like your male colleague. Then go to your boss and demand equal pay. Patricia Arquette would be proud of you. It just isn't fair, ladies, is it? A man can be sexy wearing just a suit. He bears only his hands and his face. Sleeveless, short dresses when it's snowing outside? You just can't make up this shit.